Hello, and welcome to Nightly Nerds. I'm Coke. And I'm Ginger. And we're back playing Shovel Knight again. Yay! I am absolutely enjoying the the crap out of this. I, I had a thought at the last end of last episode oh, to say no, it's gone. I was, oh, was going to say it's completely gone. It's gone. It's I gone. have no idea what it was. Yeah, well, it probably wasn't worth it. I mean, that's train of thoughts. They get derailed sometimes. All right, we're gonna go visit. Uh, shoot, what is this night again? I can't remember. I don't know. Mech Knight. Uh, tre treasure Knight. Treasure Knight. Treasure Knight. Yeah. So he's like a deep sea treasure man. Mm. Oh, like Nautilus. Yeah. So you're literally in his submarine. I'm just gonna reference other games constantly, and like Nautilus. And so now we can play Pong with uh, with the shells that we knock the the little hermit crabs out of. And because we're in water, Whee! nice. Because armor floats. Armor floats. <laughs> Maybe it's foam armor like a cosplay. Ah uh, no, <laughs> no. Uh... Are you talking to me or are you talking to that? D to that, okay. for hitting me. I was like, it could be foam armor. Not allowed to do that. It could be foam armor. Foam armor. Armor. And... I what? keep expecting to have like the... Yeah, and I, like, have a, uh, I have an empty chalice. Like in Sonic? Oh, that yeah. made any sense? Like, yeah. Where's the air bubbles? There's the air bubbles. There's the air bubbles. All right, so for those that uh, didn't know, uh, well, yeah, you won't know what I did off camera, but I, I bought the extra upgrades for my shovel. Now I have, like, a Legend of Zelda full health uh, little little ground slash beam thing, and I can now dig stuff up in one fail swoop. One fail swoop. Yeah, so, uh, like, anytime you see, like, little treasure piles, it That's just takes... That's what it was. Sorry. <laughs> I remember now what I was gonna bring up. So what? I've got glasses now, and I and you, I you four-eyed nerd. And I went, you know, thirty plus years no glasses, and I I know it was actually game night for us, like we were talking about earlier, that helped me, well, made me realize how bad it was getting. You know, just like because my vision's not horrible, I can still see pretty good. It's just. It's mostly like words, text, and stuff like that at, at a distance. Yeah. And at night, it's worse. Um, but just like when someone rolled a die, I have no idea what they, what they got, you know? <laughs> and like, I'd be like, is that a one? And like, that's a 17. I'm like, oh, man, I gotta get this fixed. Oh, I hate this. And it wasn't the one of the 17 I was seeing. I was like, just <sighs> getting it completely wrong. I hate and this part. Because spikes are like in Mega Man, one hit and you're dead. Oh, yeah, yeah. But, um. Dick. No, you come back. <laughs> but uh, so I finally got glasses, and, and it, 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 what, what reminded me is when you said one fell swoop, and like how there's like sometimes some things you don't get right. I'm sure I said that wrong before in my lifetime. Yeah, and it made me think of the word astigmatism. Oh, and for a long time, yeah, I would hear someone say, "Oh, I have astigmatism," and I think they were saying like a stigmatism. Yeah, as in it's a stigmatism, not astigmatism, like one word. Yeah. I, I heard that too for a while, but you know, I was yeah, it's that. just so I remember like trying to look school. it up online, and I'm like stigmatism, and it's just like what? <laughs> <laughs> like trying to figure. I'm already hor horrible at spelling. One of my favorite. Uh, and I'm spelling it completely wrong because I'm not. I'm getting the wrong with first letter. Oh no, it's it's in water, so he's actually swimming. <laughs> no, you get back here. Ooh. 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 <gasps> ah! <laughs> <laughs> well, at least you got it. Um. So there, there's like one of my one of my favorite little uh, uh, TV shows, or not TV, internet shows. But like back when like there wasn't too many in awe, oh, and it's like all the way over there. Uh, one of like the first like internet shows that, like that used to ever be on 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 the internet. Like it's kind of with like Homestar Runner and that kind of stuff. Uh, as like, yeah, it's uh, Foamy the Squirrel. Foamy the Squirrel. He's a very like hyperactive ranting squirrel, and. Uh, yeah, uh, one of the characters is, is uh, his name is Pillsy. He's like kind of like a, a drug addicted, uh, overly medicated squirrel, 
and he's just like he's like I I got I got eye stigmata and he's like don't you mean astigmatism no no I mean eye stigmata I mean like occasionally bleed from the eyes and just all of a sudden he starts bleeding from the <laughs> eyes <laughs> like stigmata like yes that. yeah exactly like that and I'm like oh my goodness <laughs> that's one like that, that the stigmata for me is one of those like um, scared me to hell scared the hell out of me as a child things yeah but when you're a kid you understand like why would somebody lie about you know, bleeding from the eyes or the hands. Yeah. It doesn't make any sense to you. No. So, I'm not saying everyone who's ever had a stigmata is a liar. But what I'm saying, I'm not trying to mess with anyone's religious beliefs or anything. But, like, like we were talking about uh, spontaneous combustion and stuff, you know? Spontaneous combustion. And when I was a kid, it just scared me so much that it just burst into flames. And how it was like this phenomenon. And it's like, no, it's just there a lot of people smoked back in the day and they'd fall asleep with a cigarette in their mouth and woof, you know? Whoosh. Well, I mean, the wick effect and, and you know, all that stuff. You know, the whole body is you know just essentially is. a wick. Yeah, well, it, with clothing. It's because we wear clothing. Well, and we're also so, just gigantic things of fat also, yeah, and muscle. Yeah, so the fat... Ow! No! Nice. What did I do? I totally saw that coming, too. No, um... You know, so but when I was a kid, it scared me like that. It was a real thing. Like I could just catch on fire one day. There's nothing I could do to stop it. Yeah, I think you talked about. Yeah, this too. I did. I did. But I'm ta- now I'm talking about stigmata. 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 And this is one of those things I remember, like watching something on, you know, one of those mystery things and about like some girl who mystery had science theater. No, not well. I love that, but <laughs> you know, one of those like you know. Believe it or not, type things, you know, but not Ripley's, really. Believe not, not it really, or it not, wasn't Ripley's because by then things were changing, you know, but like kind of before that, like unsolved mysteries or something, you know. I don't have to fight him. Talking about stigmata or like alien abductions and all that stuff. And when yeah. you're a kid, you just you're, you can't fathom that people would lie or that you don't understand like mental disease and that kind of thing. So you like totally buy into it, and it's scared. I was so I was so easily scared as a child. Wow, oh, poor little baby. Yeah. And I used to watch horror movies when I was a kid. Not as an adult, but as a kid. Like, Ew. I was stupid. Yeah. Like, I was like, ooh, there's a horror movie on. I'm going to watch this. You know, and then I couldn't sleep for three, four weeks. <laughs> Good I was job. That, I was that kid. And I, uh, I don't know why, but she swallowed a fly. I guess she'll die, but. Okay, so then we're going to. Come over here. You're not gonna get the. Well, I'm gonna reload the. Didn't reload. Oh. I got you. Hold on, I probably just screwed myself without knowing it. You can probably get there from the second one. Nope. Nope. But now you can get them all unless they move. Yep. Yep. Even though you did lose the one permanently, right? No, no, no I got, I got all of them. Oh, you got it before you died. Yeah. As long as you pick it up. I need some more water. Yeah, you guzzling down the water. I know. All right, I've got this, because, uh, you know, when you get older, your eyes go bad and everything else, right? You know, because I hit over 30, so. Yep, you're an old man. I'm an old man now. And I've got a dislocated rib. I think I might have mentioned that, but I have. it's the stupidest thing. I was, it was Christmas a couple years ago, and... Uh, I uh, I like to do different like smoked meats, cured meats, and stuff like you that. You like to smoke your meat. I like to smoke the meats, and I Ooh, have. Oh, we triangle. decided to do kind of like as a theme thing, and everything had to do with sticks. Like I don't know if it was like we're going for drummer boy or something, but it's Christmas, <laughs> you know. So I drummer we, we boy bought a bunch of his drumsticks meat. and turkey turkey <laughs> legs and stuff like that. We had like drumsticks for dessert. And <laughs> drummer boy smoking his meat. I'm what, sorry. Stop, stop it. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, pa pum pum But, uh, so I cooked a bunch of, like, probably 12 turkey legs and, you know, oh, I gotta three or four, That's probably four right. dozen chicken legs this is for the whole family. And I smoked them, like, you know, for three or four hours, and then I popped them in the oven to keep them warm and then prepared other things. And I went to pull them out of the oven, and I grabbed, lifted, and turned. And then my something in my back popped, and I thought I was fine. But I don't know. I was I was like still warmed up. Finished that. Went upstairs to take a shower before we started our big family dinner. Couldn't take a, couldn't take a step up the stairs. <laughs> I just couldn't walk. I was just like I can't walk, Boing. you know. And couldn't get my leg up oh, high enough. Crap. And then it was just um, right that. W- yeah, it's, it, vis- it's visitor friend Chester here. Chester. Yep. Chester the molester. Oh, we've been tricked. It truly is. It really is. <laughs> it's a tarp. We've been tricked. But yeah, I've been uh, 
In fact, oh, I kind of just on. I just dealt with it for a few years, and now I can't take it anymore. So I got I go to physical therapy now twice a week. They teach me how to stretch and <laughs> how to do certain exercises, and it, it does help. But then I also have these these couple of uh, med medications I'm on, and I'm not on any pain meds, but I'm on like a muscle relaxant and an anti-inflammatory, like prescription strength ones. And the muscle relaxant. Um, has a side effect, and this is the first time I've ever taken anything. I don't take a lot of medication. My whole life I try to avoid it. But this is the first time I've ever taken a medication where there was a side effect that actually affected me. You know? Like usually it says, oh, it can cause this, and now it doesn't cause that to me at all. And this is the first time, and it's dry mouth. <laughs> it's horrible. I don't know people who have like chronic dry mouth deal with it. It's like constant, you know? Now there's Chester. There. Ah. Heals alive. I oh, he's the one that gives you things, yep. right? That's why his name is Chester. I don't pay attention. I don't forget his name in five minutes <laughs> or less. Are you a goldfish? <laughs> when it comes to names, yes. Now we have an I, anchor. I know, I know everybody goes through this when you meet that person at a party and then five minutes later you're like, ah, did he give me his name? I have no <laughs> idea what it is. And you want to say, okay, I'll see you later, so-and-so, and you can't. Or even people you should know. Like You've met this guy like eight times and you're at some kind of something and there he is and you're ah. like, I don't know his name. Or her name. Uh, it's that. That's typically me with uh, uh, friends and and like their significant others. You don't remember their wife's name or their girlfriend's yeah. name. Yeah. Especially like if it's just a girlfriend and well, like it's just a girlfriend. This was like a new girlfriend too. Oh crap! That was awesome. That was all me. That was fantastic. I think I gotta fight that stupid little thing again. But uh, no, okay, but oh, all right. Let's go get my money back. But yeah, I totally I just don't remember names at all. I mean, ah. I have a better chance of remembering some random actor than I do, or a football player. You know, someone who plays for the Packers. <laughs> I'm like, you know, he's like the he was he was cut from the from the practice squad, but I remember his name. <laughs> oh, but I don't remember, you know, go uh, away. the guy who go uh, away. taught me for five years or something in some 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 class. I don't remember his name. Or it's like it's been so long I'm afraid to ask. Yeah. That's the other one. Like, I should ask what his name is, but I don't want it. But I don't want it because I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm so scared. I'm scared. Yeah. All right. <laughs> was... Speaking of scared, though, we're going to have to leave you at suspense here and on this on this episode. Woo! So, thank you for joining us. Uh, as always, like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, and this is Nightly Nerds. I'm Tote. And I'm Ginger. See you in the next episode. Woohoo!